Interstate 65 through most of the Lafayette area will become three lanes wide in each direction. It's all thanks to an $83 million contract that's now in place. News 18's Brittany Tyner joins us now and reports one business welcomes the expansion and the construction that will come along with it. Brittany? Dan, I-65 will become three lanes in each direction from roughly State Road 38 to State Road 25. NDOT says construction is set to start in April. One gas station clerk in Dayton says the whole project can only be positive for business. Hope you have a wonderful day. Quinton Schaefer welcomes customers at the BP gas station off State Road 38 in Dayton. He also welcomes the idea of I-65 expanding to six lanes. More lanes means more cars, means more business. Just this week, the Indiana Department of Transportation awarded Walsh Construction Company an $82.8 million contract to expand Interstate 65 along an eight-mile stretch in the Lafayette area. The project calls for an additional lane to be added in each direction from a half mile south of State Road 38 to a mile north of State Road 25. It's a, an area that has had and sees a tremendous amount of traffic on a daily basis, and it's an area that um, will benefit greatly by having that additional travel lane through there. NDOT spokeswoman Debbie Calder says construction is set to start in April, but will really pick up in the summer. Construction will take more than two years to complete, but there is some good news for drivers. They do tell me their plan originally is going to be doing some work at night so that it will minimize the impact um, to the uh, traveling public. Calder says construction will move to the daytime once the shoulder is built up to start work in the current median. And while drivers could become irritated with the construction, Schaefer hopes that will help business. People will want to pull over and uh, come in and get some stuff and stretch the legs. And whenever that happens, they can look around the store and see what they want and buy more stuff. The total project is scheduled to be complete in November of 2017. The project is one of many from the Major Move 2020 initiative by Governor Mike Pence to improve Indiana highways. Bernie Tyner, News 18.